Welcome back to GearWire.com. In this video on the DR880 Dr. Rhythm from Boss, I'm going to take a look at the Easy Compose window, Groove Modify, and how to add a little bit of guitar to your drum machine and use this thing live. Easy Compose allows you to assign automatic patterns based on the style you've selected. In this case, we have a user preset, but let's see what we can do with that. It gives us an 8-beat, 16-beat shuffle. Uh, let's go with an 8-beat. You can switch up to 16 beat or a shuffle. Switch up the percussion. And you can add bass automatically too. Switch up the key of the bass, go to chord progression. And here you can switch up the key or the type. Hit shift and pad. This will bring you over to your bass. And I should be able to go up in here and assign my kit. some dirtier ones toward the end. And you can go up here and assign automatic type as well. Uh, if I hit enter, if I go to type, it will assign my chord progressions automatically. Change up the key. If you use the step sequencer under edit, it'll actually allow you to edit within steps. Uh, get out of here real quick. So you can go through these steps and actually assign which one is which. Uh, for example, go through one at a time here. And if you want to quantize this differently as well, you can change this up and you can move a lot faster in here. But you'll see it moves across the steps and I can assign my different notes this way. Getting out of here, um, I'm going to just really quickly lay down some things using a user pattern, then we'll add a little bit of guitar. So I'm going to assign a beat using the pattern generator. I'll just assign a 8-beat, or actually 16-beat cymbal, 8-beat snare, rock pops percussion, no bass, and then go find a kit that I like. We'll just keep a user kit for now. Going back to my base pad, make sure this is selected, good. So let's record a quick bass line here. Get out of my pattern. And if you don't like the bass that you've assigned, you can also switch that up as well by going to your chord progression. Um, no, I don't want to exit. And if I hit shift record, allow me to write the pattern. So hit enter, and now it's writing. 
So now we have a pattern. Now if you like the automatic kit that comes with the bass, you can go to kit, uh, go to your bass part here, hit enter, and switch this up. increase the level. So now I'm going to talk about the guitar. You'll notice that the uh, guitar comes in through a guitar and bass input here so you can play guitar or bass along with this. There's no inbound recording uh, to the actual drum machine because there's no way to store any of your uh, audio recordings. However, it's really useful for A, recording straight from the drum machine to your computer or other recorder, and B, really for playing live. Uh, there are some effects in here that are, a few of them are pretty cool, uh, just basic distortion. I mean, this is really useful for when you're really in dire straits and you need something to just have one thing go to a board. I've got a high gain stack here. You'll notice there are a variety of other effects. Uh, some of them all right, some of them not so good. Some of them a little cloudy. We have like a wah, auto wah in here. You also have a uh, tempo delay. Well, that's the Boss DR880 Dr. Rhythm drum machine with guitar and bass input.